Issue of excess skin. Uh, when someone loses a significant amount of weight, excess or loose skin is always a common issue. Yeah, uh, because this happens. You know. Uh, because the skin uh, which stretches to accommodate extra fat doesn't always shrink uh, to fit the new or let's say new slimmer body and there are several factors that could contribute to this and today we're going to talk about that and we'll be give you strategies on how <coughs> you can be able to counter that so number one usually is the duration of the obesity uh, the longer someone has been overweight or obese, the more likely their skin is to have stretched significantly. Prolonged stretching can cause skin to lose elasticity, making it harder to bounce back when weight is lost. Yeah? So that's why I say the earlier the better. If you see yourself uh, you're beginning to accumulate a lot of fat, then begin losing it earlier enough because the more you stay with it, the more... Uh, you know your skin loses elasticity and then number two also the amount of uh, weight lost uh, that is people who lose a substantial amount of weight typically more than let's say 100 uh, let's say 50 kgs even even beginning with that yeah are more likely to experience loose skin and the greater the amount of weight loss the more the skin has to shrink to fit uh, let's say the new body shape and also one thing that also could contribute to that is age. Uh, whereby as we age, the skin naturally loses collagen and uh, elasticin, uh, which are proteins that help keep the skin from t uh, firm and tight. So those two uh, proteins, that is uh, collagen and elasti elastin. So older individuals may find that their skin doesn't retract as well uh, after weight loss. Number four, uh, we also have speed of weight loss, whereby rapid weight loss doesn't give the skin enough time to adjust. Skin has more time to shrink back if weight loss happens gradually. This is one reason why slower sustained weight loss is recommended. Uh, number five, we also have genetics, whereby genetics play a significant role in how elastic uh, someone's skin is. Some people may be genetically predisposed to have more or less skin elasticity affecting how well their skin adapts to changes in body size. And number six, uh, it's about the issue of hydration and nutrition whereby skin health is linked to overall nutrition and hydration levels. Drinking plenty of water and consuming diet rich in vitamins especially vitamin C and E and the proteins can promote uh, skin elasticity and improve the skin's ability to contract after weight loss. And also I think it's good to mention that things like smoking uh, really destroy your skin. They cause sagging of skin. Yeah, I think you have also realized that. So it's not something that just popped up. Yeah. And uh, number seven, <coughs> uh, muscle mass, whereby building muscle through strength training can help reduce the appearance of loose skin. Uh, because when muscle fills the space under the skin that fat uh, once occupied, it can give the skin a firmer look and even feel. So what are some of the strategies uh, to manage loose skin? Number one is strength training, whereby building muscle can help improve the appearance of loose skin by filling out the body uh, with the lean mass, that's number one. Hydration, keeping uh, the skin hydrated both by drinking water and moisturizing can, uh, let's say, help maintain elasticity. Number three, uh, gradual weight loss, whereby losing weight at a moderate steady pace allows the skin more time to adjust. And then we have non-surgical treatments, uh, whereby we have uh, some non-invasive non -invasive uh, options like uh, radiofrequency and laser therapy that claim to help tighten the skin through the effectiveness. Uh, but then this varies, so you should be able to check this with a grain of salt uh, because these have not been tested uh, adequately. Yeah, and then we have surgical solutions whereby, in cases of severe, yeah. Uh, excess skin, especially after massive weight loss surgery, surgery uh, like a body lift may be the only option for removing excess skin. 
And while those uh, skin can be a cosmetic concern, it's often a sign of significant progress in achieving, achieving weight loss goals. Uh, so focusing on overall health and fitness can help uh, with both appearance and uh, physical comfort in the long term. Yeah?